Welcome to this week's Canadian Whitetail Scouting segment. Locate, learn, set up, hunt. Brought to you by Big and J Long Range Attractants. The aroma is super strong. The range is super long. This week's scouting statement is a little bit about being stuck in a rut and not wanting to make those changes once the season started, even when it's apparent that you need to. This is our plot property, one of the only private properties that we actually hunt. And even here, we make mistakes. All summer long, we work on this plot, we get everything seeded. We've got set up on that south side. It's the property that we've hunted. We've watched these deer grow here for the last six or seven years. We got set up, the season came, and we're in exactly the wrong spot. We planted new things in the plot. Now that fall has come, the deer have adjusted to that and they're behaving different. We put a new dugout in here this year, and now we're finding the deer are coming through the alpha rack and out to the dugout first before they're heading south out to the egg field. So all those changes that we made all year long have changed how those deer react. So we're set up on that south side, and we've filmed multiple times now our target deer come out of this corner, through the plot, and to the dugout. And our stand that's on the far south side right now, it's just not in the right spot. That stand on the south side is not where we're gonna get a chance at that deer. So we can either wait, but that's something that we don't like to do, we don't like to wait. So we came up here, we put this blind in on the north edge. We've got it faced to the southeast. This deer are gonna come out of this northeast corner. We're gonna put some big J out here. And when they swing around, that's gonna be enough to get them to come in there and stop before they head out. It's gonna give us a shot opportunity because as it stands right now on that south side, we're just not gonna get a shot opportunity. And small changes like that, that can make a big difference. I mean, it's exactly that time of year when we should be in the stands. It's mid-October, the deer are moving and our target buck is still utilizing this plot. We're in here changing things and putting up blinds. That doesn't help them feel comfortable, but the truth is, that south stand right now, it's not where we're gonna kill that deer. So we have to make those changes. It's hard to take that day or two off from hunting to come and reassess things, but sometimes that's what you have to do if you wanna get that target buck on the ground. Whether it's early season, after season, mid season, never be afraid to go in and make changes to that setup if you think that they need to be done because hunting a spot that you know you're not gonna get an encounter in or you have a very low chance of having an encounter is not nearly as productive as going in, moving that stand. Even if it bothers the deer a little bit, at least you're in a position that you can take that buck that you're after. So the story there is to not get stuck in that rut. You know, we thought we knew what was gonna happen on this property, we got everything set up, and now it's apparent that we're not in the best spot. We could sit there, but we're gonna spend a lot of nights knowing that we're not in a good position at an encounter with that target buck. You know, we don't wanna come in and mess everything up and bother the deer, but I know that our best chance is to be in the best spot possible. And if that means coming in during the day like today when it's nice and rainy, covers a lot of our scent, we get another spot set up, it's gonna stop us from hunting here for a few days, which is, not the best case scenario, but at least in a few days when everything calms down, we can come in here and hunt. We're in a spot where we might actually have an encounter with that target buck, and that's our goal at the end of the season. And that's your Canadian Whitetail Scouting segment for the week. This week's Canadian Whitetail Scouting segment has been brought to you by Big and J Long Range Attractants.